Coach Mama here with another Mama Minute. Today I would like to talk about life coaching and how it works. I would like to compare it to having surgery. Now let's say you needed to have knee surgery. Of course, you would not call a life coach. You would call a surgeon. And you would go to a hospital for surgery. When you come home, you might have to go to physical therapy or you might have to follow up with your doctor who told you that you needed surgery. But when you find yourself struggling with the pain or struggling emotionally because you have to lay down all day and can't do your favorite sport, or when things at work get tough or parenting's hard because you're not up, can't get up off of the couch, you might want to call a coach. A coach can help you to think differently, can help you with some practical strategies, and can really change your life because you're changing your mindset. A coach doesn't tell you what to do in terms of physically how to fix that knee. A coach doesn't repair the problem in the knee like the surgeon, but a coach can use mindset tools, cognitive behavioral therapy skills, just to show you what you're thinking. Cognitive behavioral therapy is just the idea that your thoughts and your beliefs end up being your behaviors. So what you think about something makes you feel a certain way and then you act a certain way. That's all that means. And a coach can listen to all your thoughts and all your feelings about your pain, your physical pain, maybe some emotional pain, uh, maybe some depression and anxiety about your surgery before or after. And a coach can just show you what you're thinking and give you some new thoughts to think, help you to find new thoughts that are true for you and beliefs that are good for you and that help you. So that's how and when you would call a life coach.